So Sam, firstly, you look absolutely stunning today. And I can't believe that you're my husband. I know everyone says it, but I actually am the luckiest guy in the world. So Sam and I met way back in 2011 under the O2 sign in Lancaster City Centre, now a pilgrimage for both of us. So before we'd met, Sam suggested that we went for a few drinks in Lancaster. It sounds really cheesy to say, but we got on so well, it's like we'd known each other for far longer than just a few hours. And I know this may seem, seem really easy to say now, but honestly, I knew in that moment that you were the person I was going to spend the rest of my life with. I just knew on that first day. Sam, you're the kindest, most loving, generous guy in the world, and nobody makes me as happy as you do, nor does anyone make me laugh like you do. You're my best friend, my soulmate. The reason every day of my life is filled with joy and happiness. Something that you once said to me and that stuck with me forever, and that is, wherever you are, that's home. But for all the things I've said and all the things that I could say, quite simply, Sam, I love you. Nick and Sam wish to marry, but in each other's company they have found fulfilment and love. As a consequence of this love they have drawn closer and now wish to offer to each other the security that comes from legally binding vows sincerely made and faithfully kept. You are the special people that they have chosen to be here today to witness this occasion and to share the joy which is theirs. Sam, today I stand by you, happy and proud of the special love that we have for each other. Today we celebrate all that lies ahead. I promise to love, cherish and respect you in all the days of my life. I pledge to you faithfulness and friendship in good times and bad from this day onwards. Nick, I promise to give you my love and friendship and to be there for you when you need me most. To laugh with you and cry with you. To trust and confide in you. To comfort and support you. All that I have, I share with you. I promise to respect you and be faithful always. These promises I make to you for the rest of my life. You have both made the declarations prescribed by law and have made a solemn and binding contract with each other in the presence of your families and friends here today. It is my privilege and my very great pleasure to declare that you are now legally married. And Nick, I invite you to kiss your new husband. <laughs> Nick is the one that keeps our Sam's feet on the ground and takes great care of our Sam. I hope and know that our Sam and my daughter-in-law <laughs> will have a similar relationship to ours over the coming years and they will build many happy memories together to Sam and Nick. cracking sense of humour. You're also such a kind-hearted and assured and calming presence and I think you're the absolutely perfect husband for my brother. I couldn't imagine our family without you at this point and I genuinely mean that. Love each other dearly, choose each other every single day of your lives, keep growing and nurturing the wonderful relationship that you two have built together. I love you both very much and I wish you all the happiness in the world. If God please raise a toast to Sam and Nick. To Sam and Nick. <laughs> 